Hello and welcome back, my name's Jay Riviera and we are back with more Invisible Ink. We are currently doing our Synergy run with Banks, International, blah blah, Seed and Parasite. We picked up some server programs last time round with Wrench and Oracle, which I think is going to be pretty, pretty good for her, as long as we're not at... As long as we're not um, in a Plaztec where they can actually rehack the stuff that we take over with hackers, then we should be okay. Sorry, I had to let me cut in there. Um, so yeah, the items that we have look pretty solid at the minute. And our programs are good. So now what I want to do is I want to start getting some missions under our belt. So I think we're going to go with the lowest um, travel times. Going from here to here to here. Because, oh, Plaztec though. Maybe we'll skip over that and go to... Well, we'll see what pops up from the executive terminals. Not all but are I've got some brilliant news. Um, obviously I've been off the grid for a couple of weeks. You know, I've been working with some problems that I'm having away from YouTube with, like, me system and me recording software and stuff like that. And I've pretty much not actually been paying attention to what's been coming out on Steam. But, today, I noticed that the Clay Weekender is offering like a big bundle for 22 pounds it is, English pounds, um, and in there's a DLC for, well, an expansion for Invisible Ink, which as soon as I've finished recording this video, I am going to download, have a look through, and I'll probably be doing double runs. I will be doing, I'll be continuing this series, and I will also be, um, Starting a series with with continuity, I cannot remember what it's called. Continuity plan, something along them lines, which I think is going to be awesome. I've, I've been waiting for more content for this game. Obviously, when it came out in early access, well, when it came out of early access, it stopped really updating. But now the fact that they've brought along. Four more agents, two new starting programs, a longer campaign mode, and a hell of a lot more content. This is going to be awesome. We're going to just go on melee here with Banks. And then International can just make our way up. And what we'll do is we'll shut this door just to make sure if anybody does come through this door, we are covered. So let's end the turn. Let's have a little peek. Right, so we've got somebody patrolling in and out of this room. So let's just have a further peek. I would kind of love to know what their patrol was, but it looks like I'm going to just come here, bring Banks to here, shut the door and hope for the best, really. Hope that they face away from the door. Because if they come to here, they're going to be not looking at the door. We can steal from them, get behind to here. We do not have a security card. That's what I'm hoping we get off this guard. So let's end the turn. Oh, that is right. We've got to remember. We can do this. And we took over this camera here. Which is awesome. It gives where somewhere to aim for. Parasite's still free, so... Ooh, I would love to know what Damon's on there. Parasite's still free, so we will pop a Parasite on there. Right, awesome. We should have really done Oracle last turn as well, but I forgot about it. Um, 
Right, so this guard doesn't actually enter into this room. Which is probably a good thing. So let's bring Banks up here. And we'll have her peek through both of these doorways. Is that guard right outside this door? No. Right, we kind of get in to catch him. So, more demons as well. No remaining uncaptured cameras. Hmm. Is there only one camera? What we've got here, an armor level one guard. It's all good. So what we'll do is, uh, see now, we've got to come back here anyway, so we'll probably take that demon just before we leave. It is bad that we've got both guard spawn rooms next to the elevator, but then again, you know, it's not really too much of a problem. We will bring Banks along, we'll shut this door. Then we'll bring in National up here. And just make sure that we've got vision on this room. And let's end the turn. So right now what I want to know is... What's in here? If there is a console in here, because we need to take as much from consoles as we can. And that should have got that safe hacked. Yep. Awesome. So what we've got here, we don't know yet. So international, come through. Let's have a little peek through here. Nice console. We'll actually observe his path. Just so we know where we are safe in this room. So yeah, if we come here, take down this console. And then if we stand here, he should pass us straight up. And we should be good. So, Banks, we want you to head into this room. We'll shut that door just in case International needs to come back through. Let's open this door and get a bit more vision on the room. Right, okay, so when that camera does come active, that means that Oracle will actually prop again but we can't patrol any further we're gonna have to wait here getting a key card is going to give her much more maneuverability through this area and we'll have international investigate over here and banks will start heading our way up to this safe over here to try to pick that up so yeah let's end the turn there I want to steal from this guard. There we go, there's a security card that we we're looking for. And then we'll just hide behind this wall. International, steal from him. Take your monitors. Then we'll have a little peek through here. We have a turret. Okay. It's not too hard to take down. I'm actually going to use wrench for three power. 
well, zero power. And then I'm going to put a parasite on here. Which will allow it to move through the room now. And actually take control of the turret next turn. So if we head in, let's shut the door. We will use nothing because we have one more turn cooldown on it. Hmm. Right, I want to get into a position where I can quickly get into cover. If anybody comes through this doorway. And now we should be good to end the turn. Yeah, but I'm dead excited. Like, I actually only seen, like, literally, as I loaded up Invisible Link here, I actually seen the expansion for the game. And, oh my god, I nearly burst. I nearly burst into, into flames because obviously, as you know, I have played the shit out of this game. We cannot hit both cameras, that's way too far away. Um, so what we will do is... We will use Data Blast on... These two here. And then Parasite should still be free. And we'll pop it onto there. Awesome. Let's see what we have going on through this room. What's that? Daemon database. That's awesome. Right, we'll wait until next turn though. Let's open the door, have a further peek. And we've got another console and a camera. Right, so that's all good. I'm actually going to quickly grab this console here. For the monies. And then head back out, shut the door. We can hack that down at any opportunity. We do not need to take down this camera. And if we hang around for a little bit, we can take this console as well. Right, that's kind of what I was hoping wouldn't have happened. That guard being... Stopping by that door, but I kind of knew that it was going to. So if we just... Do you know what? Do we take him down? No, I think we can move a little slower. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop into here. Hide again, let him come back, and then we'll go and see what's in this room. So, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we need nine movement. <clears throat> I think she has nine movement, just in case, oh no, we need ten movement. 10 movement to be 100% of being safe. If not, we can just go on melee and deal with the situation. So let's just end the turn there for now. <coughs> Sorry about that. Then we should get access to this camera here. Awesome. We'll bring International back over here. 10 movement. So if we head up, have a peek through this room. Do you think we have too many credits? Rectify that problem at this nanofab. Awesome, we'll hit that just before we leave. He doesn't come into this room, he comes to here. So let's find a safe area. We have two exits to this room. I'm guessing that this one probably goes to, well, they might both actually loop around each other. But yeah. We'll find out what these demons are and... S
Knowing that the daemon database is only one and we have no parasites on anything, I was happy to use Oracle. It did take this camera, but I didn't actually know if there was any other cameras on the map. So, just as a chance, I went for it. But yeah, um, this mission's going pretty well so far. But I think I'm going to actually leave it here. Actually, right, um, the blah, blah, blah. I don't know how long it's been. So yeah, I'll probably just leave it here. And yeah, so please do drop a like or a comment if you did enjoy the episode. Stay hidden and I'll see you next time. Cheers. Bye.